on to the next thing, I guess. Well, today we're going to do a little project together with uh, Puck. Um, she needs a chair. She's grown out of the, the tall one and we have a low table here. And uh, all the other chairs are kind of in states of disrepair. As you can see, this broke off because she threw it over and then all these uh, uh, I don't know, even know how they are called, but the spines, I think, or spindles, I don't know. They all fell out and we have more of them and they are all in various states of disrepair. So, um, as you've seen, we've built a lot, of with, uh, a lot with pallets, uh, so I thought this is another challenge we can do with pallets. So uh, we went together down there to the offcut. Uh, pile and uh, we found some stuff that I think might be suitable for building a little chair for her. doesn't need to be tall, I think 30 centimeters for the seat and 60 centimeters in total. Uh, 
that's uh, uh, that should be enough. Um, so uh, what I'm going to do is I'm gonna uh, cut these lengthwise, rip them to size uh, or down the middle, and um, these will be the 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 feet uh, or the legs. I mean, the legs and the backrest and. Um, I do another one and I'll cut that one to size and it will be with the front. Um, I don't like measuring too much. I mean, I, I know these are 60, so I'll I'll use the 60 as a guide there. And um, I'll just keep keep cutting as long as it will, uh, as long as it takes me from, uh, to, to form a chair. That's the, the challenge. Um, I have a circular saw that I will use for the rip cuts and I, I think I'll do the rest by hand because it's uh, I, I don't like the noise and uh, it doesn't take that long to, to cut through, cross cut through these uh, pieces of wood. Um, okay, um, I'll uh, start and I'll show you what I'm doing. Goed je snel in. Een stuk beter dan die andere. Dit? Dat is een mooie stoel. Oh, uh, dit? Ja. Jouw, jouw stoelpuk. <laughs> 